What does it truly mean to remember the poor? How does our response to those in need reflect our understanding of God's love and justice? Welcome to the unveiling of grace program of the Marthoma Youth Ministry of the Mumbai Diocese. Tomorrow we will be meditating from the gospel according to St Matthew chapter 25 verses 31 to 40 based on the theme remember the poor. In this passage Jesus speaks about the final judgment where he separates the righteous from the wicked. He commends those who cared for the least of his brothers and sisters emphasizing that whatever kindness shown to the needy was akin to showing kindness to him. This passage serves as a reminder of our responsibility to remember the poor and the marginalized in our midst. Here are three takeaways. Number 1, the divine mandate for compassion. In verse 40, Jesus says, "Truly I tell you, whatever you did for the one of the least of these brothers and sisters of mine, you did for me." This statement encapsulates the essence of our Christian calling. Our Lord entrusts us with a divine mandate to care for the marginalized, the downtrodden, and the poor among us. It's not merely an option, but a sacred duty. As followers of Christ, we are called to embody his love and compassion in our interactions with others. Jesus reveals that when we care for the least among us, the hungry, the thirsty, the stranger, the naked, the sick and the imprisoned we are ministering to him directly number 2 embracing the other as christ it's easy to overlook the marginalized in our society to pass by those who are in need without extending a helping hand too often we fail to recognize the face of christ in the poor and the marginalized however jesus challenges us to see him in every person we encounter especially the poor and vulnerable when we serve others with kindness and generosity we are fulfilling our divine calling to reflect the character of Christ and lastly cultivating a lifestyle of compassion remembering the poor is not merely a one time act of charity it's a lifestyle characterized by empathy generosity and sacrificial love as we try to imbibe the teachings of Jesus let us actively seek opportunities to serve the marginalized to advocate for justice and to alleviate suffering wherever we encounter it dear friends let us examine our hearts and ask ourselves how do we remember the poor in our daily lives do we let us commit to tangible actions that demonstrate our love for others whether it's volunteering for a social engagement supporting organizations that serve the marginalized associating with mission and ministries of the church or advocating for systemic change may god strengthen us for the same amen